Hello friends. Welcome to Route 360. Today I'm going to talk about alligators. Where does the name of alligator come from? The name alligator is probably an anglicized form of El Lagato, the Spanish term for the lizard, which early Spanish explorers and settlers in Florida called the alligator. Later English spellings of the name included alligator and alligato. What do alligators look like? Male African alligators average 8 to 10 feet long, while females tend to be slightly smaller. Very old males can get quite large, up to 15 feet long and weight in over 1000 pounds. Alligators have a long rounded snout that has upward facing nostrils at the end. This allows breathing to occur while the rest of the body is underwater. The young have bright yellow strips on the trail. Adults have dark strips on the tail. It's easy to distinguish an alligator from the crocodile by the teeth. How many teeth do alligators have? Alligators can have up to 80 teeth at any time. New teeth grow to replace worn ones and throughout the lifetime an alligator can have between 2000 and 3000 teeth. Difference between an alligator and a crocodile Although often confused with crocodiles, alligators can easily be distinguished from crocodiles by the shape of their snout. While alligators have broad U-shaped snout, crocodile snout are V-shaped. Where do alligators live? The alligator's habitat is freshwater environments such as rivers, swamps, marshes and lakes. The American alligator can be found from North Carolina to the Rio Grande in Texas. While the Chinese alligator was once widely distributed across the eastern part of the Yangtze River. Its range is now restricted to a small sections of the river. What do alligators eat? Alligators are mainly carnivores, although they have been found to also eat fruits such as elderberries, citrus, fruits and wild grapes. They primarily feed on insects, spiders, worms, snails and small fish. As they reach adulthood, they start to consume large prey such as bird, turtles, snakes, mammals and large fish. How to find their life partner? It's not exactly storybook's romance. Since most gators play the field, whether male or female. But researchers found that in one wildlife refuge, up to 70% of females stood by their men. Year after year, it appears to the gators are acting like some famous species of birds that matter for life. Hello friends, subscribe my YouTube channel, you can see important videos my channel. When do alligators give birth to cubes? When an alligator finds their potential mate, they initiate direct courtships by rubbing and pressing each other's snout and backs. Once mating is complete, female alligators construct nest made of vegetation and mud. They can lay over 50 eggs on this nest in a single season. Mother alligator will cover them with more mud, sticks and plants and wait for their arrival during their 65 day incubation period. Alligators are amongst the most attentive parents in the reptile world, tending to remain with their young and care for them for as long as 3 years. Are alligators sociable? Alligators are sociable and like to hang out in groups. A group of alligators is known as congregation. What are the amazing characteristics of alligators? Alligators are to the Alligators continue to grow throughout their fitness lifetime. They can use tools, they balance sticks and branches on their heads, attracting birds and looking for nesting materials. 
Alligators have two kinds of works. They have high work and low work. Alligators are ecosystem engineers. Alligators play an important role in their wetland ecosystem by creating small ponds known as alligator holes. Alligator holes retain water during the dry season and provide habitats for other animals. Alligators are apex predators that also eat fruit. They were recently reported to also eat fruits such as wild grapes, elderberries, and citrus fruits directly from trees. Alligators may help spread the seeds of these fruits throughout the habitats. What predators do alligators have? Small alligators are eaten by a variety of predators including raccoons, otters, warden feeds, warding birds, and fish. However, large alligators may be their most significant predator. Adults, cannibalism, intraspecific fighting, and hunting by humans are probably the most significant mortality factors. How we protect them? Hunted widely for meat and belly skin, while makes high quality leather, the alligator was listed and endangered in 1967. Despite these text designations, persistence portions continue well into the 1970s. Concerted conservation efforts prevailed, however, and the creature was removed from the endangered specialist list, list 1987. Now, over 1 million live in the wild. The Nature Conservancy is helping to further protect these incredible reptiles by conserving and restoring the wetland habitats on which alligators live in. For example, TNCs adapt on agri programs aims to protect 250,000 secrets along the Gulf Cod, including lausinas, coastal swamps, and alligator favorite. Hello friends, kindly subscribe my YouTube channel. You can see important videos in future. Have a nice day.